Hi, I want to tell you um, one way that I introduced the concept of um, water as a, a, a element that, or a characteristic of all living things, uh, a, a need of the human experience for sure. Um, when working with four to six year olds, children don't really understand, especially if they are in a place um, where water is not um, difficult to find, for them to comprehend that there might be places where people can't find good water and what does that mean? It, it, for four to six year olds it's really hard to explain that. So um, what we can though talk about is that it's a human basic need and it's also a source of joy and comfort and beauty. And I want to introduce that to students with a, a book called A Cool Drink of Water. And I think I'm going to go ahead and read this to you because it's so quick and the pictures are, tell you far more than um, what I can explain. Somewhere, right now, someone is drinking water. Scooped from the river. Drawn from a well, caught as it drips from the roof. Everyone, everywhere a nice, cool drink of water. And in this book, there's a nice resource for the um, connection to the locations geographically of the photos, which were beautiful in this particular book. Uh, it's a starting point for lots of conversations. Um, but I think when you're talking with four to six year olds, you have to talk to them from their point of reference and ask them um, where they get their water, where does it come from, you could extend this to why is it important to um, conserve water, to take care of the amount of water that we use in the daily activities that we have. Um, so this is a discussion uh, starting point and you would springboard other activities off of it.